Alrighty, well, hi everybody, and um, it's cast time once again, and yes, this is a very, very early cast. Um, it's 10.46 p.m. I had just gotten through, um, I had just got through recording my, uh, Gems of War video, my, uh, my weekly PvP one. I'll probably talk more about it here in a little bit, but let me go ahead and intro this music. Uh, it's gonna be Pico, um, Carpathian Pico, um, Troll Ambient Synth. But it, um, I played this during my, I played this during my Gems of War video, um, so I'm. This is kind of a risky one because I didn't do a copyright check on it. But usually music like this is very, very rarely copyrighted anyway. But I still don't like to take chances. But I still don't like to take chances. But once again, I just finished up with Gems of War. I just want to go ahead and do this one too since I have everything all set up and stuff. And then, um, I might talk more about it later, but I just, just, here, just let me, um, let me just go ahead and get the music going. And, um, but, uh, tomorrow, and tomorrow, like has been going on for the past few days, there's gonna be a chance that I might do another D&D Beyond video. So, I'm... It, I've just been pretty much a content creating machine right now. But anyway, um, to start with. So this time around, I decided to forego the uh, Cook Serve Delicious stream. Um, just one, my hands are uh, my hands are a little bit sore, a little bit hurting from playing this game for the past few days. I mean, especially around the thumbs from like constant, you know, constant button mashing and you know having to smash down on all four buttons at the same time that kind of thing and just all the repetitive motion and plus uh i have to work tomorrow so i i don't want to i don't want to strain my hands any more than necessary because i'm gonna i'm gonna need them for the work week so so instead what i decided to go ahead and do is just uh fire up some idle champs you know some idle game and just Basically, give you know, kick back and give my hands a rest. And then, um, on top of that, I think uh, today, like yesterday, I think uh, most, if not all, my sleep was a uh, dream and nightmare filled. So I basically woke up half asleep. So I wasn't really in much of a condition to play that game anyway. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a drink of some Arizona green tea. But otherwise, while that game was running, um, just watched a few podcasts. Um, there's a, I think I talked about it in yesterday's cast. One of the, uh, one of the D and D sessions I'm trying to watch. Um, I recognize the uh, the blonde girl, or one of the, one of the players was a blonde girl, uh, but she was on this uh, today's cast in a, or today's podcast from a. Uh, Idle Champs, I think it's called. But yeah, Brand Spank and New came out today. Gave that one a watch. Um, another podcast that came out. It's a fighting game podcast called Triple KO. They had a Brand Spank and New one out today, so um, watched about half of it. And then um, and then later on. I I did manage. That's what I was wanting to say. Um, earlier, because uh, mainly out of habit, because Tuesdays is usually it's usually definitely pinball day because it's a new matchup week. But I think just out of habit, I started firing that game up. But when I did, my computer uh, my computer crashed. It just decided to suddenly restart. So, well, I'm going with that one. But later on in the evening. I just went ahead and um, I went ahead and fired it up again, and it didn't crash, so it worked all right. So I just went ahead and um, did my um, did my weekly matchup league, and just I actually I think I actually did pretty good. Like uh, I beat the top score on three out of four games, so I should be uh, I should be pretty good for the rest of the week. 
I shouldn't have to like go back and do maintenance or anything. So. Um, and then after that, like I said, I I was trying to make a decision between either recording the session, doing a stream of the session like I did last week, um, or just or just bucket it all together and just just playing it off, playing it on my own time. Um, on a whim, I decided to just go ahead and record the session and then eventually uploading it to YouTube. So we're probably looking at about a, or here, I could probably, uh, I'm, I'm hoping to, yeah, I'll play it safe. As I was say, sometimes, um, if I open up a folder, and uh, if in that folder it shows a it shows a video that's currently recording, I have had this happen before, but it could end up corrupt it could end up corrupting the file, making it useless. So I'll I'll play it safe. But but usually, Gems of War videos, um, have a pretty heavy file size, usually around two gigabytes. So you're looking at at least an hour for it to get all squared away and taken care of and all that. But like I said, um, did my uh, one-hour session, uh, got my PvP tier from 15 to 1, so it's good to go for the week. And then, and then, and then working on this cast video, and then on top of that, I think I told, I think I forgot to, I forgot to post in my Final Fantasy 14 block, so I still got to. I still gotta fill that out. So yeah, gonna have a pretty damn busy night. So. so today was a day of forgetfulness. But otherwise, like I said a few uh, like I said a few moments ago, there's gonna be a chance that Well, mistake number one. Just, I was in a hurry. So anyway, but yeah, like I said, um, tomorrow morning there's still gonna be a chance that uh, I might do a D and D Beyond video. Same thing I've been doing for the past few days. Just working on my uh, working on my half orc monk. Uh, Way of mercy for those that weren't around, for those that didn't see yesterday's. Um, I said this in other videos, but uh, the Way of Mercy, the Way of Mercy monk in Dungeons and Dragons is what you get if you, if a plague doctor, at, or a plague doctor slash field medic, and a Shaolin monk had a baby. Like um, you know monks, they, you know they do all the normal things that you see monks doing, you know, punching a kick at and you know. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. What a, oh, 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 you know, you know that kind of thing, and but then on top of that, they they also have healing powers. But if you've ever played a game called Final Fantasy Tactics, this this basically is exactly how the uh, the monk in that game plays. Again, martial arts, um, and they they're they're they can also uh they're also magic they can also heal magically, um. Now, in Final Fantasy Tactics, they have an ability. Um, they can inflict what's called death sentence, where after three turns, you drop dead. Um, in D and D, they kinda have that, um, as well as uh, they can uh, they can heal damage. They can also inflict damage just by merely touching them, like touching a cert touching certain pressure points on them. So yeah, they they could um, I think it's class. I think it's classified as a, uh, they call it necrotic damage. I don't really know what that means unless it's like, uh, unless it's like acid damage or something. Like, uh, the, the damage, necrotic damage, it, um, uh, I don't think it, I, it doesn't, he it doesn't heal back naturally. It's kind of like acid damage. The damage you inflict, the necrotic damage 
is basically permanent damage. It can only be healed magically. I think that's how it works, because it's not a... It isn't like a... It isn't like poison damage. Poison, in the first and second edition of Dungeons and Dragons, I think it it actually was statistical hit point damage. It, it, it was just another type of damage you can do to a target. In this game here, um, if you're poisoned, you're, um, the short answer on it is, uh, all of your rolls are penalized by 50%. It's just, it's the easiest way to explain it. But anyway, um, but anyway, Way of Mercy monks, that's, that's their, that's their main shtick. They're, they're martial artists and they're field medics. And, oh, and also they're, um, and from what I read in the, uh, in the 5th edition rules, there's also some, uh, Dr. Jack Kevork in them in as well, because they've had a, for, for people that are, like, terminally ill, you know, if they're, you know, if their death is imminent, you're, um, you're the, you're the one that actually comes in and euthanizes them. So, yeah, they're euthanizers, too. So, I'm, uh, I'm gonna take another drink. And then on top of that too, um, these kind of monks, the they they can uh, they can also wear masks. Now, the the poster boy picture that they usually have is uh, one wearing a wearing an actual plague doctor doctor mask. You know the the big long beak. But you can um you can choose any kind of mask you want. I mean there's and if you couldn't decide, there was even a little table there. It's like six options, you roll a six-sided dice, and you just pick what, whatever number comes up. I went with a Beholder. Um, originally, it was going to be an eyeball mask. I, I talked more about this in that in the, in the D&D Beyond video I did this morning, but <clears throat> but uh, I went with a Beholder. Originally, it was just going to be a plain eyeball mask, kind of a, kind of giving a nod to my all-time favorite band, The Resonance, but after one, after visualizing it, it would, it would just look too comical. It looked too silly, and two, um, I kept thinking there was this kind of, there was going to be this chance that I might be, I might be get a, might be getting sent a cease and desist from the band, saying I can't use that eyeball mask unless I pay like a licensing fee. So I don't want to have to deal with that. So I went ahead. Well, then the other brainstorm I had, why not a beholder? So that's. So that's what, that's the mask that he's going to wear. He's a beholder mask. So, but like I said, if if I get around to doing the uh, D&D Beyond video tomorrow morning, I'll probably talk more about it. This computer's been good with the alt tabs. Um, for those that are wondering why, um, whenever, uh, whenever I have to, whenever I have to alt tab, I always say, I hope my computer don't crash. It's because, uh, about a week or two ago, on two occasions, that's exactly what happened. Start up my computer, but the very moment I hit alt tab, the screen, uh, goes, it'll either go black, as what happened, I think, the second time. Where it just it just flat out restarted, or um, it all it, the first time it uh, I think it turned the whole entire screen became kind of a kind of a navy blue color for a few seconds, and then it went black and then started restarting. All that just by simply hitting Alt Tab. So yeah, I'm that's why I that's why I often say I hope my computer don't crash. It's it's just I'm real skittish on using it. But otherwise, um, that's going to do it for me, everybody. I'm going to go ahead and call it good here because um, I still have my Gems of War video that I got to get uploaded and processed and all taken care of. And I still got to do the same thing with this video, too. I got to get all uploaded and processed. 
and then possibly later on to later on uh, tomorrow morning I might have that that D and D Beyond video too that I also gotta work on and then get uploaded and processed. So I've just been a content creating machine today. So but but aside from that though, um but uh this will be my last cast for the week. So my work week has started up Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. That's my work week. So as far as cast videos go, you won't be hearing from me again until Sunday morning, so but otherwise, hey, thanks for tuning in and listening to me, everybody. I appreciate that. And um, and once again, um, until Sunday morning, take care, everybody.